Hey, 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 hey. Okay, guys, I'm just going to do some tousled kind of textured hair today. I'm going to show you how that's done. I have sectioned my hair into two sections, and I have not gotten, like, too precise on it whatsoever. Um, you know, just as long as you've got a top and a bottom, you're good to go. So starting at the very back of my hair, I'm just going to add a little bit of texture. I'm just going in at the root, doing one twist and pulling it out okay just like so and i'm going to work my way to the front and i'm not getting all like specific and carried away about like clean sections and all this jazz so I'm keeping it really simple here um and i'm picking up fairly large sections because the smaller the section that you pick up the more curl you will actually have to your hair okay so you guys can see what's going on there um I do have a lot of shorter pieces around my face, which I'm gonna kind of keep till the end. And I am just going to bend it ever so slightly. Okay, you guys can see that. So, like, I'm not doing anything too uniform here. You know, not worrying too much about keeping everything balanced, um, keeping it super easy picking up sections and just going in at the root, twisting it once and pulling it through. The longer you leave the flat iron in the hair, the more curl you will get. So you wanna work quickly and um, you know, don't, don't hold it there too, too long. Um, and if your flat iron has an adjustment on it for heat settings, um, adjust it accordingly. So however much hair you have, the density, the thickness, the texture, and how much curl you actually want, okay? So these little short puppies here, I'm just gonna do a light, a very light bend, okay? And voila, you guys can see. If you need to smooth out some of the ends, this is a good time to do that. Just take your flat iron, and just gently smooth out your ends, okay? Step one done, moving on to step two. I'm gonna keep the front of my hair out since it is shorter, but again, starting at the back, I just wanna create texture. Going in at the root, flipping and pulling down straight, okay? Like that. Again, picking up, picking up another section, going in at the root, and pulling down straight. Again, and pulling down. Now, if you need to bend anything more, let's go in and do so. Voila, like so. You guys getting the gist here? Do the same thing on the other side. And this doesn't have to be super consuming, guys, Like or like taking up a lot of your time, honestly. Um, Sometimes I think there's too much effort put into like clean sections and doing all that stuff. I mean, you want to make sure that you're picking up all the pieces that you need to pick up, but don't get like crazy on that. Like don't go super nuts on um, trying to find exactly the sections that you need, okay? I mean, it's going to turn out messy and tousled, so you don't have to worry about precision and finding sections. Uh, 
That's a little too curled for me, for my liking, but that's okay, we'll work with it. And as far as this front section goes, ever so slightly. Okay, so voila, okay? You can see that the texture is in the hair, okay? Now, I'm just going to um, let it cool for a minute. And then I am just going to start at the back and I'm just going to finger, finger it out. Okay. And if you feel like you need something else, like if you feel like there's a piece that's too straight, then pick it up and give it some texture. And voila, there you have it. So the key elements to doing something like this is make sure that you use a thermal product on your hair before you start using any heat to, to make sure that you are protecting the hair. That is really, really key. And the other thing that I want you guys to remember is do not hold your hot tool in there for too, too long. Depending on how well your hair curls, I mean, you'll have to be the judgment on that, but the longer you hold, the hot tool in there, the more curl you will get. And remember, sectioning is not crucial to be precise, but remember the amount of hair you pick up will determine the amount of curl you get. Okay? Hope that helps. And I hope you guys enjoy your tousled hair. Ciao for now.